let's go into our shoulder wrap first. So this is the um, angel wings here. Mm -hmm. Just try to line it up on the lower shoulder so you can pull it up to your neck. Put your thumbs, so pop your thumbs in there, touch your thumbs together. The less, the better in this position for comfort. Yeah. At least don't grab it now, so we're a little extra today. We're gonna take the feet in, straighten your legs, and then cover yourself in the blanket. So push on the hammock, pull the hammock over your legs. Make sure you cover your knees. You could do this at the ankles too, but it's more comfy at the knees. After you got your blanket, grab the hammock up here again and just kind of touch it together at your neck, make sure it didn't move. Then thumbs up, thumbs on the hammock, hands inside the hammock, grip your fingers and turn your fingers towards you. Straight legs up, it's tight. Your feet overhead. So remember, you're pushing your hands towards your feet and your feet over your head. And then come into, I can't see you, so I'm going to talk you through it. Come into the uh, mosquito first, so your legs are straight. Yes. When your legs are straight, you can let go inside the hammock, push your hands out. Remember, I use the slushy five. Yes. So you want to just spread your fingers, these are your wings, and that's also holding you in. So you want to keep pressing out there. Knees down and just relax. This is our gargoyle, so you just relax here. You can let your arms even relax. You can keep your wings out. This one is nice because you can let go. It's like child's pose, but upside down. And then vampire, we bring our belly to the floor. And look up. And everything open up and stretch. When we come back, you're gonna grab onto your wings right where you were holding before. And I want you to stick your butt into this little pocket. So you're sitting to your heels. Then grabbing on, you're gonna pull down. Your elbows are gonna come down and sit back. Take your arms to the back, bringing the hammock under your arms now. Once your hands are, yeah, bring your arms all the way back. Let go and bring your hammock under your arms. Then grab onto the edge, on the, yeah, the back right there. Kind of hold it here. Taking, so your elbow's gonna stay under and it's gonna create a pocket. So it stays under your arm and you come through the middle. And then oh, elbows are in that pocket. So you wanna, yeah, there you go. So once you're here, you hold on here, nice grip. Lean forward and let your back bend as much as you're comfortable. So this one's um, a few different arm movements. The first one, I like this because it opens up your back a lot. If you take your elbows down towards your chest, so right here, it doesn't bend your back as much. And then there's one more if you let your hands go out and reach up as high as you can. You can get that arm extension. You make sure you're holding, your grip is holding you in. So if you let go, you go down. This one, you can just get the whole extension to your arm and your chest. And I like this next one. So we're gonna bring our arms back again and sit. So straighten your legs. Just grab that back edge again and straighten your legs out. So once we're here, we're gonna open the knees and bring the arms forward. But the hands are gonna do the same thing. So you're holding it like this. It's underneath your arms and you have the hammock in your fingers. Then you keep it just like this. You bring your arms through, your elbows are back into that pocket. Then let go, take your fingers and release them. And just have a seat. This is a nice place to rest in the middle, in the middle of all the things. And let your hands to your forehead. Kind of like a Buddha Kanasana. So the trick to the next one, I think you've done it before. Um, you want to aim your feet towards the floor, the plumb line. So it's down, not out. If you go out like this, it's not going to work. Your arms stay here. You pull and you push your feet down. And you're going to stand up. Good. Keep your knees wide. So knees wide behind the, the yeah, there you go. There's a little like tough spot there. And then your elbows stay under and you can lean forward. If you pull on one and then the other, you can move. If you pull on them both at the same time, you will steady. So this would be nice ambiance in the corner. <laughs> Just spin around. Open up your arms. Stand. This is 
opening up your hips. So you're gonna, to get out of this, I'll show you, you don't have to do uh, like a quick, too quick of a drop, but you're just gonna sit, sit your butt back and lean back. The hammock will be around your back, so you won't fall. Pop your feet out. Take a little walk to the edge. 